Yeah, that's something I didn't sell in the main LP, uh, you actually fight this thing, or something like it, uh, remember it, you have to, like, visit it as soon as you can, and then come back, and you'll be in, and something will happen with it. I don't remember what exactly, but I definitely missed it. Okay, now can I believe this enough? Probably could, but boy, that would be rough. One fire. Yeah, something like you would click that to turn the pool filtration system on, and then by it's all filtered out by the time you. Uh, Get near the end of the part where it was it. The part where the ship starts sinking, like the second time. How do I get up to that? That's just from under it. So, that over there. Looks like I do. There's gotta be something up there. Maybe it's not so much a boss, but if that happens, I don't know. Like I said, I've never actually done it, I just looked it up when I realized that I probably missed it. Two of them. Oy, oy, oy. Plus one shooting. I'm not gonna mess with it. Just get these guys to kill these ones. Why not? 
debating sniping it from here, but uh, whatever I get for this is probably going to spawn over there or it's going to be an old key. So if my son is late. Man, I did not think this one would take three parts. I didn't think raid mode would be longer in the actual game. I don't know if it is or not, but it's looking like it. Man, at this rate, I'm tempted to give it some playlist. You know, I had a really stupid idea last night. Is it make like a fighting game with all the final bosses of all the Resident Evil games? Let's call it Tyranny. Like, I can't even remember all of them. Like, I think the first one was Thanatos in the first game, and Mr. X, and William, and Nemesis. And then, I know it's not the final boss, but the, uh,. But Gigantis thingy on four and then the final boss of four, I can't remember what that one was. And this you know, due to all the tyrants and really big and mean creatures from all the rest of the games. There's one like gigantic rampage style beat 'em up fighting something. I don't know, I think that would be a really cool idea. Just make it completely over the top, don't go for any sort of realism, and just make it like 80s style Michael Bay explosions everywhere. Alright, I think that's everything. I think we can finish this. Can't look at a map at all. No, I can't. Alright. I'm gonna assume I got everything. I know one of those doors is still locked. I'm gonna take a guess that you use that key on the door I did. Oh, uh, the other door. One probably has a weapon case. 
well obviously one did have multiple weapon cases. Whoa, stuff respawn. I've been in here, right? Yeah. So, I mean, one probably has, well, one does have weapon cases. I'm guessing the other one has a weapon itself, and you have to pick. That probably would make sense. And I'm not going to do this level again when it's taking about going on 50 minutes, and I'm still not done with it. Maybe? And I said, no, it's maybe. If I have to grind again, I'll grind in this level if I get some really good XP for it, and then sell it off, but I'm not guaranteeing that at all. I mean, unless I get like 10k XP, I'm not going to do this for really. me. It's fun, it's definitely fun. It's just for the time it takes, and from the grinding, I want to do it efficiently. Hmm, I wonder. Yeah, I'm gonna go through the promenade again, even if we spawn them, and they might give me another key. One sec, I'm going to cut my foot, I'm going to stop my recording for just a sec. Okay. I didn't want the footage to corrupt because it was, I've never had a uh, video, I mean like a chunk of footage that long, and that sounds weird. I didn't want it to like crash or something, so I just stopped it for a second. I don't think Audacity or Crash from having sound file too long. Because sound files don't really take up much space to begin with. Okay, what do I have ammo on? This? Yep, I was right. Well, it looks like it's not a choice. I get both. Unless something else crazy happens. Like another old locked door sends up. I went the wrong way, didn't I? Yes, I did. Back this way. I don't like that sound. I really think something's gonna pop out. I don't know. Maybe that's just for background sound for that room. I think it's a bridge, this is where that room was. Very funny thing. Like maybe four weights or some pop out or something. Um, um, anything for value. Anything is safe. 
Gonna go mark. Anything else? Hmm, just not. That's eh, not horrible. I guess it just depends what mod I get out, but. I would have been mad if I would have got one started right here at the end. Even here. No. At least I assume this is. I'm not taking chances, I'm retreating a little bit. Did I get what was in a safe? Yes, I did. I like bug the AI out because that one wasn't swinging at me at all. That one looks stuck. These these are not Resident Evil One hunters. Those were unforgiving. Any pufferfish? Take another quick spin oil. Yeah, if I don't cut anything out, this is going to be almost exactly three videos. Oh man, I cannot imagine doing that no hit. Yeah, XP wise, that's definitely not worth it.
oscuro lo listo. Alright, well, that was the longest level like ever. So, I'll see you guys in the next episode. This is New Tide 5 video.